So there are three classes uh, right now in the biomed pathway. Your first year will be principles of biomedical science, first year class. Second year class is human body systems. Uh, and then the third year class is going to be medical interventions. They have to do career journals starting in principles of biomedical science. So by the time they've gone through principles, HPS, and MI, they've probably looked at, I'm going to guess roughly 75 to 80 careers where they have to do research on it, look at the salary, the education required, uh, the, the job duties, and all that. So, I mean, it kind of covers the gamut of anything that you can kind of call that biomedical field. So, like I said, from sports medicine to, to PAs to um, from the top to the bottom, that's kind of what we cover. We have EMTs come in, EMTs come in and talk to them, and EMTs basically let us know that right now they'll hire almost all of our kids right out of the gate at 18 and, and give them a job as an EMT because of the training that they get and the tools that they use in our class that they don't get to use in other classes. You've got to be passionate about science. You've got to want to learn. If you're somebody that's curious about things and always wants to know the why, the why, the why, that's what we do. We go through and, and, and do the why uh, and show them how to learn to learn again. One thing that's really cool about this course is uh, my degree uh, that I graduated with was cell cellular and molecular biology. Um, these kids are doing stuff that I did my junior year in college, so that's pretty amazing that you'd be 14 years old in this class doing the same things that 20 year olds at colleges are doing. Uh, so, Principles of Biomedical Science is the first year biomed course. Um, it's kind of a sampling of everything that's to come in the later courses. Uh, it starts out with somewhat of a forensics unit where you're kind of investigating a crime scene. Uh, throughout the course, there's this um, female, Anna Garcia, who you have found dead. Uh, you work her crime scene. Uh, it's up to them to work through basically all the labs that we have set up. Um, so it's kind of a little bit um, CSI based, uh, but it's definitely more um, biomedical. So what that entails is a lot more biology, chemistry. Uh, this is typically for your kids that want to go into a medical profession as opposed to uh, like a CSI or forensics position. The first year course really is to teach kids to be problem solvers and figure out how to get this stuff done on their own. Uh, a lot of times like with inquiry-based science, you do a lot of hands-on activities that they don't really know what they're doing. These guys jump in there and they do it all and we kind of just facilitate. second year class is human body systems. Uh, it's kind of a continuation of what you learn in principles of biomedical science. Um, the cool thing about the human body systems class is you start out with this uh, mannequin. It's like a little skeleton about this tall. Uh, and pretty much from scratch using clay, you build a person. So we go over all of the major body systems uh, and you're going to as we progress through the course, add those onto your mannequin and by the end you have a full-fledged person that started out as just an empty skeleton. Your class is medical interventions and what we do in that one is we expand upon everything that we've done in the previous years. Uh, they start looking at case studies for um, different outbreaks of diseases. They kind of come up with how a colleague should deal with a fictional meningitis outbreak. They talk about the plans that they need to do and, and what they need to, to set up to make that successful. So they kind of expand upon everything in that, that area. They follow another fictional family, the Smiths this time instead of Anna Garcia, and they go through and they're doing labs that quite honestly we didn't even get to do until we got into college. They um, are doing genetic engineering. We actually take two different bacteria samples and we create a unique bacteria that's got two different characteristics of each bacteria. So they, they're jumping up the level. The stuff that they're doing in the MI is, is real world stuff that's gonna get them jobs in the medical field.